gifts and talents of all who gathered here this evening. After yesterday, I thank Father William from St. Felix de Valois Parish for the celebration of the graduation mass. It was truly a wonderful and faith-filled celebration for those deserving students. We thank him for the gift of his words on that day. In the days of Saint, our patron, Saint Jean Baptiste de La Salle, the torch of Christian education was alight. This analogy rings well for the graduating class of 2023. You are now the torchbearers, and it is your charge to keep it alight and burning, to make good use of your talents and gifts, to pass on to those you meet who will claim your richness, to trust in your own voice, to trust in the God in your heart, to be the eyes, the words, and the actions of Jesus Christ. Our thanks and appreciation must go to the Highview Function Centre for providing us with this absolutely beautiful facility. Without their support this year, it would be difficult for us to have to organise and hold this special event. Some housekeeping notes, toilets are outside the function doors to both the left and to the right. As we come to the end of the senior education, we as a community celebrate the candidates of 2023 HSC class. After some long, grueling months of committed study and preparation, it is encouraging to see these young men and women energised for the upcoming HSC. I was very impressed at the recent graduations, rehearsals and assembly. The dedication of these students has very much impressed the staff and myself. The students were very mature, very mature, as they left the college grounds on Monday after their rehearsal and again on Tuesday after their mass and awards. I thank the Year 12s and their families for the memorable experience they have shared with us over the years and I wish them the very best as they embark on their future endeavours. I sincerely hope the LaSalle community has successfully enriched these young men and women with a sense of confidence and pride. I hope they will long remember their time at LaSalle Catholic College. I now welcome Father William to the podium to share grace with us. Please begin to quieten down. Prayer is very, very important in our lives. Thank you, Ms. Dowd. Um, I don't think Father has to really say too much, but uh, just again on behalf of myself, Father Van, and our Archbishop Anthony Fisher, may I congratulate the class of 2023 for all your accomplishments this year. And also, as I said in my homily yesterday, I pray to Almighty God that you will all stay connected with each other, that you will again, you have one life to live, so please use it to the best of your abilities to please make a difference in this world. We need people like you to make a difference. And as I may share with the parents here quickly, I've, I've always said to our students here that just because they come from Bankstown does not mean they still can make a difference in the world. You're in a perfect position to make a difference in the world. So please don't let your thinking that where you come from, where you study, has no bearing. You had made a difference in this world, and by God's grace, you'll be able to do it. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Blessed are you, Lord God of all creation. Through your goodness, we have the gift of life, the food that sustains us, and the faith and friendship that enriches us. We ask you to bless the food that has been prepared, and those who have prepared it, through Christ our Lord. Amen. St. John Baptist de Vassal, pray for us. St. Felix, pray for us. Live Jesus in our hearts. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. And just before we uh, uh, begin our meal, could I ask at this moment for Isabella Wien to please come up? Is Isabella, is she here?
As you all know, yesterday, uh, Isabel was, was, has been presented with the Archbishop's Award yesterday. It wasn't physically at the school yesterday, but today to her parents and also like to just present Isabella and make up and present her with the Archbishop's Award today. Congratulations, Isabella. Thank you, Father William, for sharing grace with us, and congratulations, Isabel, again. Could I ask now, this is our final, final formalities for this evening, could I ask the four captains to step forward, please? Our two college captains, our two vice captains.